There is so much more to a healthy forest ecosystem than just the living trees. And after a tree dies, it continues to play a really important role for the rest of life around here. See, large chunks of dead trees like this are what's technically known as coarse woody debris. Though the word debris here is a bit misleading as it suggests that they're you know, useless or not that important to the ecosystem, which is certainly not the case. So let's just call them downed wood or logs, yeah? So this downed wood here creates an important feature not only for wildlife to use as home and shelter as they decompose to provide shade and shelter for delicate saplings growing nearby or as a nurse log for other trees to germinate on and get an advantage above the forest floor, but also for the function of these forest microclimates. See, logs like this absorb a ton of water acting as giant sponges on the forest floor. You can actually press against one a few days after rain and see how waterlogged they become. Water, log, get it? It's a pun. Anyway, these hubs of moisture remain damp throughout the hottest of summer months, which adds humidity to the forest floor as that water slowly evaporates, which results in cooler, more temperate climate that also increases the forest resilience to wildfires as wet things don't burn very easily. That moisture in this down log can also act as a reservoir during a drought as rich layers of fungi inside help break it down and distribute that moisture to surrounding trees and plants in need through mycorrhizal fungi connections throughout the forest floor. Us humans are such fidgety little creatures that when we see wood like this in the forest floor, we immediately think it's a waste, so we try to salvage it or use it as fire firewood or we clear it out of the way thinking it's a hazard but down wood like this is crucial to the ongoing health and function of these ecosystems as a whole so we really just need to learn how to let things be so we can all benefit from a healthy forest ecosystem pretty dang neat